Hello, hi Jumbo. Habari yenu karibu sana to my channel. It's none other than Sharon aka Wabaraka and I am back with another video. If you are new here, karibu sana. You are very welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, again you are very very welcome. I keep telling you you are the reason that I keep coming back to give you more and more content. Now, in today's video, I am going to be answering some of the questions that you people have been asking me about. It's all about getting jobs in the UK and today I'm going to talk about the the jobs, the skilled jobs that you need to apply for to come and do if you want to come to the UK to work. Now, if you have not subscribed to my channel and you have been listening to my videos, please don't go beyond this step before you subscribe hit that red subscribe button subscribe to my channel don't forget to like comment and share this video so that many other people out there can benefit as you are benefiting so i'm going to give you one minute to subscribe if you haven't subscribed then we are going to continue with this video <laughs> What skills are required to apply for a job in the UK? The list is endless. The list of the jobs that you need to apply, the skills that you need to have to apply for a job in the UK if you are coming from outside the EU, outside the UK. Let me just say outside the EU because the EU people can still come to the UK and apply for, for a job. I'm particularly talking about if you are coming from outside the EU the list is endless i mean i'm going to take you i'm just going to go to the gov.uk website that is the official government website that publishes all the information that you need i did show a video previously and that shows how you need to get into that website and you should be able to get that information it's www.gov.uk and if you search for skilled work you are going to find the information there that you require to apply there's a long list i'm only going to concentrate on 10 top jobs 10 top jobs that you need to be skilled to come and do and if you remember i said previously that even an a level if you are if you have an education up to a level you could still be categorized as a skilled worker so you don't have to have a master's degree like previously you only need to have up to a level education to make a, an application, you have to have a job offer from an approved employer. You have to be able to speak English. You have to um, meet the threshold of the 70 best points before you make the application to, to come to the UK to work. So let's go straight into it. I'm just going to read into this website. And at the moment I'm looking at the occupation list which is really really long it this by the way was updated on 6th of april 2021 this is the skilled worker visa and the the eligible occupations and their codes so i am going to leave this I'm going to leave a link in the description box. This list of the skilled occupation that you can apply for jobs in the UK and you can have a look at those in your own free time. The list is very, very, very long. It is endless and I just want to go through a few of them. Then select the top 10 that most people are currently applying for if they want to come and apply for jobs in the UK. So starting with the very top you have things like chief executive and senior officials and the related job titles that you need to be applying for that is chief executive chief medical officer civil servants or vice president these things like production manager and directors in manufacturing so you have things like engineer manager 
managing director operations manager productions manager blah 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 and all that i'm just going to scroll down this list like i said it's a very long list i'm just going to scroll it down to see the list of people that don't have to require a master's level degree or even a degree level people who maybe only need a level um that they can apply for jobs right so we have things like leisure and sports manager um we have healthcare practice managers those are like clinic managers gp managers gp is like a family doctor here in the uk they are called general practitioners or gp okay so garage management all those are management positions we're scrolling down we don't want management positions right now we know management positions is one of the things that um, will be required civil engineers are at the very top there it's a professional career we scroll down and we come to it specialist so if you are an it specialist you can apply to come to the uk to come and do it right uh if you're a programmer software developer you know a lot on all these things to do with website yeah you can do that it is not a professional qualification that so that i'm assuming and i'm only saying that because there is no bracket that says you have to be a, you have to do this at a professional level or at a degree master's degree level it does not specify that Right, so we have psychologists. With psychologists, you do have to have a, a qualification. So you'll have to have gone to the university and got a degree for that. Occupational therapists, if you're an OT, nurses, and nurses are usually in the shortage list in most of the time. And I'm also going to speak about the shortage list in a bit, but if you're a nurse and you want to come to the UK, even if you don't meet the threshold of the 25,600 pounds per year, you could still be eligible as long as as long as this career is within the shortage occupation list. So those are people like district nurses, health visitor, mental health nurse, psychiatric nurse, staff nurse, even student nurse. Okay, so they can all apply to come to the UK as long as they have those skills. Architect is another one. Okay, probation officer, social workers, if you're a social worker, it can be psychiatric social worker, senior practitioner, or just a normal social worker, and you want to come and work in the UK, you can apply even if you are outside the EU. All right, scrolling down, it's a very long list. I'm going down, 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 down to youth and community workers. So these are people that you don't even require to have like a master's level degree. If you have uh, a level, it could be enough to come and do youth and community work. Uh, that is uh, people that support youth support the youth as community workers or as or as youth coordinators day center workers day center officers key workers outreach workers debt advisors drug and alcohol counselors all those so like you can see that is a very 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 long list carrying on things like uh, or people like artists if you're talented if you're a very good artist you could make an application for a job and and get a job offer uh, those are like portrait painters sculptors you know there are people who are actually very talented they don't have to have a skilled or to have a master's degree but they are really really um, skilled and they have an a level education you could be eligible to apply for a job here in the UK. Actors, entertainers, presenters, ballet dancers, composer, musicians, uh, pianist, organist. The list is endless. I'm just scrolling down very fast. Okay, now let's go into the top 10 skilled jobs that 
you can have and apply to come to work in the UK from the long list that I have just gone through with you we're just going to select the top 10 starting with number 10 chefs if you're a chef whether it is a pastry chef no more chef I don't know what chef or chef 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 you just know yourself if you're a chef you can make an application to come to the uk provided you have a job offer you can speak english and you meet the 70 eligible points you can make an application to come to the uk that is number 10 at number nine is artists so these are people like music directors musicians produ producers uh, dancers all those in that category can again make an application as long as they have a job offer from an approved employer they can speak English they meet the the criteria of the 70 best points you can make that application number eight social workers so if you're a social worker and you're from outside and you want to make an application to come work in the UK that is another hot hot job number seven we have graphic designers i have researched this and i have written them down according to how i have seen so if you're a graphic designer and you are interested to make an application to come and work in the uk from outside eu there you are teachers these are people like secondary education teachers university teachers you can make an application to come and work in the uk architects are in demand in fact architects are in the shortage list so you will be able to get a fast track application if you're an architect and you you want to come and work in the uk you will be eligible okay scientist again scientist is another one and that is number four scientist you will be able to get a fast track application these are people who are good in uh, things like mathematics, chemical scientists, biological scientists, biochemists, all those people that are highly skilled in that area, you can get a fast track visa because that is also a job that is in the shortage list. All right, at number three, top hot job engineers, and it is all engineers, whether it is a mechanical engineer, um, bio uh, medical engineer, all the engineers you know aero engineers chemical engineers if there's anything like that basically anything to do with engineering it is a top 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 hot job for people that are willing to come and work in the uk it is in also in the shortage list category you'll be able to get a fast track visa for that at number two is medical category so it's what i spoke about things like nurses doctors psychologists medical doctors gp practitioners you know general practitioners um radiographers veterinary surgeon occupational therapists actually also fall within the medical profession you could make a you could make an application you'll be eligible it is in the shortage list and again you'll be eligible to make an application to come and work in the uk and number one perhaps with no surprises is it so if you are an it specialist and you wish to come and work in the uk it is also in the shortage list you can get a fast track visa for this one and as long as you have an approved offer from an approved employer you can speak english you meet the 70 best points you will be eligible to come and work in the uk and with it we're talking about people like programmers business analysts architects system designers cyber security specialists all those people in that category they will be eligible so, so you see the list is endless and those are just the top 10 that i have given you there's many 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 more if you look in that list that i'm leaving in the description link you can check what skills that you have that you could be eligible for making an application for a job in the uk so i'm going to leave it at this it's a wrap guys and until we come and do the next videos i'm going to leave it at here thank you very much for watching my videos thank you for coming back to support me share my videos with all your friends and don't forget to subscribe till the next video guys
Baraka.